George Clooney shocks Amal Clooney with confession over $500 million fortune. George Clooney and his wife Amal Clooney have been among the most successful couples both in Hollywood and outside of the celebrity world. The power couple has been married for over six years now, and their marriage has only gotten stronger. Recently, George has gone back to gracing magazine covers in the past months as he prepares to return to the screen. In one of his interviews, George confessed to having spoken to Amal fleetingly about his $500 million fortune. Clooney's huge fortune apparently is not going to be inherited by his much younger wife and mother of his children. George tells the story regarding the time he wrote his will back when he met Amal. George shares that when he was writing his will, he apparently just met the humanitarian lawyer at that time. When he was asked by Amal where his money was going to go after his death, he confessed that a majority of it would be to his friends. I just met Amal, but we weren't dating, and I was making out my will, and I was like, well, I am going to give to these guys, so why wait until we are all buying dentures? Clooney said. He explains that most of his friends have family and children that they are putting through college and such, and most of them did not get as lucky as he did in life. George further shared that he was broke for a long time and pretty much did not have anything, leading him to appreciate what he has and which only made him more aware of how hard life can be. Sharing the story of his own mother to the magazine, George narrates that his mother really had it hard back in the days. He continued saying that his mother was working two jobs while taking care of him and his brother at just 19. Other subjects that Ocean's 8 actor talked about is his quiet life in Oxfordshire. George expresses how normal his life is living in a little village in Sonning where he and Amal, and their twins Alexander and Ella are living throughout the pandemic. He shares his joy in how the townspeople treat them like any other person. He does confess that he is upset that he and his family will not be able to join Amal's parents and his parents during the Christmas festivities this year due to the pandemic. 